All right, guys, I, ju I just couldn't wait any longer. Uh, don't judge me on some of the stuff I used to mock up my exhaust. Dug through the rubbish bin and bent up a bolt and this tab. Come up with that real quick for the, the outer support. Uh, I do got my, my stack on there. I do have throttle linkage. Um, if I stay with this carb, the choke will be getting jerked out and I'll JB weld up the holes. Uh, there's the nothing pretty, but I uh, wanted extra because with the other cylinder, this kept, kept working its way loose. But uh, there's that. Uh, I will uh, get my earplugs in here and uh, start it up. I got it somewhat rough dialed in on the bench here. Uh, it's running on regular uh, gasoline, 50 to 1, uh, red armor at the the moment um i have the high speed in quite a ways to get the clean up which that's a good thing because when i go go to nitro i'll need to fatten it up so um the idle side on the other hand is out quite a ways but let's see if i can get it to start up There it is. It, uh, I think it. Uh, I'll give it a couple heat cycles. I'll probably dig out a bar and chain. Maybe go give her a give her a test whirl into the wood. Uh, yeah, uh, it definitely don't feel like a forty nine ten anymore. It actually feels really heavy with that pipe and stuff on there compared to how a normal uh, forty nine ten uh, feels. And then. As this pipe gets warmer, the tune uh, changes on it. So, you know, I don't know. I'm hoping it's got some good power, but we'll have to find out. I'm sure it'll all change when I go to nitro. I did have to drill a couple holes to get to the adjustment screws, but uh, I'm pretty happy with how the throttle feels. Um, yeah. So, on to the next uh, next problem. Let me know what you guys think of it. You guys have a good one.